Hey, what's up guys? This is Anthony from Anthony's Customs, and for this review, we're going to be looking at the Marvel Legends Cannonball figure. He came in the two-pack with Domino. I just reviewed her yesterday, so if you didn't see that video, go back and check it out. They're both really cool figures. I recommend, I'm going to say right off the bat, I recommend you get the two-pack. It's a really nice set, and it's becoming harder and harder to find, especially in good condition, and mostly because of this guy. The, we've seen this in a Ghost Rider figure also, but this guy's whole upper body has a very soft, like a foam rubber jacket on it, which is kind of cool, and they probably thought it was a really good idea when they made it, but this stuff deteriorates like crazy if you don't keep it in a nice climate-controlled environment, or if you stretch it out or anything, it will fall apart very easily on you, so be careful with that. It also affects the paint. The paint's not the best on the soft parts, but still this guy has tons of Really cool parts. I don't know if he came first or if the Ghost Rider did. If he came first He's got tons of original parts. If he didn't then almost none, but still it's very lightly used They've only used it I think on him and Ghost Rider, so it's very cool and really nice sculpt work on this guy He's got of course an original head decent paintwork on the head not the best but his eyes are looking off to the side, so that makes for kind of cool posing opportunities. The head's on a ball joint, so a little bit of motion up and down and side to side, but full swivel, ball hinge shoulders with a bicep swivel, double jointed elbows, a wrist rotation, wrist pivot, and a finger pivot. He has an ab crunch. Again, be very careful. As you can see, the soft rubber here is on top of the other part, so you can screw that up pretty easily, so be careful with that ab crunch. He's got a waist twist, T-jointed ball hinge hips with a swivel built in. The hips are sculpted and painted to match the pants, so that's really cool. Double jointed knees, a shin swivel, an ankle pivot, an ankle rocker, and a toe pivot. So he's got all the articulation you could want. Paint apps are pretty good. He's got his buckles painted and the white stripes and the brown patches and everything like that. So he's got a decent paint job. Just be careful around the torso. That's where you're going to find most of your paint issues and most of your deterioration due to this soft material. So be very careful with that. But otherwise, he's a really good figure. And in conjunction with Domino, it's a great two-pack. And I really do recommend you pick it up. So please go do so for your own sake. Thanks for watching, guys. Stay tuned for more figure reviews, more custom figures, and other good stuff. In the meantime, keep collecting.